Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft is rolling out KB5001716 for Windows 10 once again. And this is an update that Microsoft rolls out on a regular basis every couple of months or so. And the update is also rolled out using a controlled phased approach. So it doesn't arrive globally for everyone. It, it gets rolled out in different regions at different times. And 5001716 applies to Windows 10 version 22H2, 10 version 21H2 and Windows 11 version 21H2, funny enough. Now, the update is quite small. It gets downloaded and installed automatically onto your device. I've never had to restart my device after the update has been installed. And the update itself cannot be uninstalled, so just take note of that. Now, when the update is installed, Microsoft says Windows may attempt to download and install feature updates to your device if it is approaching or has reached the end of support to your currently installed Windows version. So the reason this update could be getting pushed out now is because of the upcoming end of support of Windows 10. Now something else the update also does is if we head to our apps, apps and features, and we go down towards the bottom of the list, it installs this little tool. Update for Windows systems KB5001716. It's only 864 kilobytes, so it's very small. And although the update cannot be uninstalled, this tool can be uninstalled. And what the tool does is after it's installed, Microsoft says that Windows may periodically display a notification informing you of problems that may prevent Windows Update from keeping your device up to date and protected against current threats. So as an example, you may see a notification informing you that your device is currently running a version of Windows that has reached the end of support lifecycle or that your device does not meet the minimum hardware requirements for the currently installed version of Windows. So I think the reason this update is now getting pushed out again is because of that upcoming end of support. So just keeping you guys posted, if you are still on Windows 10, that's the reason you are getting the update, and that's what the update more or less is all about. So that's KB5001716, which Microsoft is rolling out once again to ensure Windows 10 is upgraded to a supported version. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.